Today, we are reviewing medieval gamisons that we've worn for Steel Warrior films. Welcome to my closet. First on the roster is the Arthur Canvas Gambeson from Medieval Collectibles. This is made of cotton canvas with polyester padding, and it buckles in the front. It's nice and thick, which provides some protection on its own, as well as padding for heavy armor. So this gambeson is three pieces in one. It can be worn as just a vest, and you can also tie on the tassets for a longer gambeson, as well as the sleeves if you want full sleeves. Here's what Joseph has to say about his experience with the gambeson. Pros, it looks great, feels like you're actually wearing armor, and it's great for when it's cold out because it keeps you warm. Cons are if it's hot outside, even if it's like 80 degrees outside, you're gonna warm up pretty quick, and it can be a little bit stiff, a little bit bulky, even without sleeves. But overall, I like it. I think it's cool and it's pretty nice. Similar to the Arthur Gambeson is this padded vest that I got on the Medieval's storefront on Amazon. So if you're looking for something that looks pretty much the same as the Arthur Gambeson, but want to go with something a lot cheaper, this will be your go-to option. Aside from pricing, the big difference is um, the material. So this is, it is made with cotton, but it's a lot more lightweight. It won't provide as much protection, but this makes it perfect for really warm climates, flexibility. I really enjoy this vest and I think it looks great, but if you're looking for something that will actually provide protection, then your best bet is to stick with Medieval Collectibles and go with the Arthur Campus Gambeson. Next up is this quartered black and yellow Gambeson, also from the Medieval's storefront on Amazon. It ties on the front as well as on the sleeves. So this Gambeson will provide some protection because it is decently thick, but it's still pretty thin in comparison to um, gambesons that you'll find on Cult of Athena or Medieval Collectibles. It is, however, extremely comfortable um, and it is lightweight, so it actually is perfect for LARPing or acting. I wore it during a LARPing event with Felon Fair back in 2020, so I have a love-hate relationship with this gambeson. I love it because it is very comfortable and it looks cool. And the fact that it does tie in the front and it has these ties on the sleeve makes it cool. The only problem with that is it can be inconvenient sometimes. So the sleeves here, like the, the string here on the sleeves, if they are not tied properly, if they come loose, they get in the way when you're sword fighting, which is annoying. Um, and then if you need to like switch the gamison on and off really quickly. Again, it can be inconvenient because it ties. So it kind of just depends on what your situation is. Um, normally I would say, yeah, this is great. Like if I'm gonna be in this for a long period of time, I'm all in. But if it's one of those things where I gotta switch up quickly, I don't always prefer to wear this. Um, Jacob has worn this gamison and he has some things to say about it. I like it. I have a 40 inch chest and about 23 inch arms. Everything fits really well. They have extra room in the elbows, which in a lot of gambesons you don't find. Another great gamison from the Medieval's Amazon storefront is the full length Akaton coat. This one ties at the side and it comes in a lot of different colors. This one's really cozy. Obviously, it doesn't fit me, but it does fit Dawson. And one thing I'll note about this gambeson is that after we bought it, um, Dawson actually replaced the green clasps and uh, put on brown suede instead. Um, and he may have made a few other adjustments. I know we kind of made it look older and used um, instead of as like a vibrant green. Originally, it was very vibrant. So we made some changes to it for our film, Nothing Shall Hinder. It was padded, but it wasn't very hot, which is cool. It's probably because there's no polyester, you know, no synthetic stuff in it. And really comfortable. Sometimes the collar on these goes up too high on the front and, and rubs on the underneath side of my chin, and that feels bad. So this one did not do that. But the sleeves were a bit short, although the Gambeson did, it actually did fit pretty well. My favorite part is how it's asymmetrical. I like things that don't fasten right up and down the middle. If you'd like us to review any other gambesons or costumes, then leave a comment. 
All of the products in this video that I mentioned are going to be linked in the description below. Links from Amazon do help us out, as well as the affiliate links from Cult of Athena. However, um, Medieval Collectibles is also another really great resource for all things medieval, armor, you name it, they have it, that's just to help you out. I hope that this video was helpful and you enjoyed it. Subscribe to our YouTube channel if you want to see more content like this, as well as epic sword fighting videos.